Danish long ball. Welcome to another episode of Sports Encyclopedia series, where you can learn about every single game that's ever existed on planet Earth. Friends, today in our Sports Encyclopedia series, we talk about Danish long ball. So let's begin. Danish long ball, also known as Swedish long ball, is a bat and ball game that was developed in Denmark. The game is a combination of baseball and cricket. The objective of the game is to score more than the opponent's team. How to play Danish long ball. Danish long ball is a team sport in which two teams compete against each other. One team is the batting team, and the other team is the fielding team. The batting team is required to line up beside the home base and selects a batting order. The fielding team places themselves up beyond the front line. One player from the fielding team plays the role of catcher, and another plays the role of pitcher. The catcher stands behind the home base, and the pitcher stands on the pitcher's mound. One player from the batting team comes to the home base, and the pitcher pitches the ball using an underhand throw. The batter is required to run towards the runner's base whether or not they strike the ball. The batsman is required to drop the bat inside the home base area before running. After arriving at the runner's base, the batsman can either stay there or run back to the home base in order to score a point. If the batsman chooses to run back, they can't return to the runner's base. Both teams take alternating turns in batting and fielding. A player is considered out if 1. The hit is caught by one of the fielding team. 2. The ball does not touch the ground in the marked area. 3. If the fielder hits a runner with the ball. 4. The player runs outside the sidelines of the square. How to win in Danish long ball. The team which has more points after the match ends is declared as the winner. Friends, this is just an overview of the game, but if you'd like to know more about the rules of Danish long ball, comment down below. If you like the video, hit the like button. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.